strengthening ties and extending cooperation to a new level. India and Panama inked MOUs on exemption of visas for holders of diplomatic and official passports and agriculture in the presence of Vice President M. Venkaya Naidu, President of Panama, Juan Carlos Varela Rodriguez, and Vice President and Foreign Minister of Panama in Panama City. At the end of the discussions, uh, an MOU on visa exemption for diplomatic, official and consular uh, passports was signed. Uh, there was a work plan on cooperation in agriculture that was signed. Uh, there was an agreement to establish a parliamentary friendship group uh, for the entire Latin American region from the Indian side, which would of course include Panama. Uh, then uh, two lines of credit were announced by Government of India by Honorable Vice President. One is a $10 million line of credit for uh, in, in biotechnology and the other is a $15 million um, credit line in innovation sector. After receiving the Vice President at the palace, President and Vice President of Panama held four-hour-long high-level delegation talks with him and discussed matters of crucial bilateral importance. Later, in a joint statement issued by Vice President of India along with the President of Panama, the Vice President said India and Panama always had cordial ties. Both countries resolved to combat terrorism in all its forms and manifestations. I had very useful, meaningful, constructive discussions with the President Varela, which covered all aspects of our relations, including bilateral, regional, and multilateral issues. Our interactions highlighted our common values for democracy, pluralism, and inclusive development. It also reflected the spirit of solidarity, cooperation, and mutual respect. We resolved to fight the scourge of terrorism in all its forms and manifestations and agreed to strengthen cooperation in combating terrorism in the international forum. Vice President Naidu lauded Panama for including India for strengthening relations in its Falcon policies. He also said the two centers, one for biodiversity and innovation, will be set up by India in Panama worth $10 million and $15 million each. The President of Panama pointed out that in their new foreign policy, which is called the Falcon uh, policy, uh, they have in fact identified India as uh, an important partner with which they would like to do business. He definitely once again reiterated an interest in inviting the participation of the Indian uh, professionals uh, in uh, further growth and development of Pan Panama. And to that in uh, direction, uh, the president informed our vice president that uh, they had introduced new laws that would encourage greater um, investments uh, in their cologne-free um, zone and also eased their visa uh, policies to allow greater Indian participation, Indian business, Indian tourism, uh, for uh, into Panama. So those were very important elements. The Vice President further added that in order to boost cooperation in key areas, both the countries have agreed to strengthen cooperation in tax information, economic cooperation, air services, traditional medicines, culture and space. Vice President of India M. Venkaya Naidu has held high-level talks with the President and Vice President of Panama and both the nations have agreed to extend cooperation in fields of taxation, biodiversity and all other crucial issues. In a joint statement, both the leaders have condemned all forms of terror and have decided to act against the menace of terror globally. With camera person Prashanta Karmakar, I am Rajkamal Rao, Rajya Sabha TV from the city of Panama.